a friend has loaned us a car for the weekend and we're heading into Praia today, but we are having so much trouble getting around <laughs> because the streets here are like, there is no rhyme or reason for them. It's like they're twisty, twirly, windy, whirly, and they're all one way. <laughs> But we don't have our GPS because we're out of internet service right now. So uh, this is what it was like before GPS. Just trying to smell our way through the town and get to the highway so we can get to Praia. But also, we don't have a map. So. Yeah, we also don't have a map. <laughs> While we're here in Praia, we figured we'd stop by MJ to see how they're doing. And to see their boat. And it's raining. There they are. It's really raining hard, so I don't want to get out of the car. <laughs> They're gonna come out and uh, join us for lunch. Okay, get the windshield. That is crappy out. It is horrendous. Am I getting the, or is he? Oh, he's coming. All right. Yeah, it's right. Do you guys want to go to Quintas? had a really nice afternoon with Matt and Jessica from MJ Sailing. Um, I feel like this time we got to connect and talk a little bit more. We, we took them out to Quinto de Azores, our favorite little spot uh, to eat, and we just had a really nice leisurely afternoon. We also got the results of my CAT scan for my eye. Way back when I went to the eye doctor, they told me to get a CAT scan. Um, and I did, and it was totally inconclusive. There's nothing wrong, so that's good news. And uh, also bad news, because it means I'm just feeling random pain for no reason. Idiopathic pain. Yeah. <laughs> Our day is far from over. We are headed back into Angra, where we are going to be picked up by our friend Pedro, who will take us all the way up to the north of the island, to the northern tip of the island called Biscoish, where we will be getting a tour of a vineyard. Oh, how beautiful. Wow. We're going down into the vineyard now. So, this is, um, old, uh, Labels. Uh, Labels. 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 They are the place is uh, in your brain. Uh -huh. This is the mechanism that makes the wine. So that you can stand on the tower and see all of the vineyard. This mechanism makes the smag, and after this, they, they put inside of the, the press, and after this, they put in the, in the cuba. Ferment. Mm -hmm. uh, fermentation. Okay, Ferment. so it ferments yeah. in there. By, by 12, 12 days. Okay. With, with, uh, with, uh, cold. Cold. Uh, with cold. To, to make the metam metabolism of the levadura <laughs> uh -huh. work slowly to, to keep the aromas of the, the, the Okay, okay. Yes, inside. And after this, after the uh, clean, they put inside with the pressure to, to, uh, to maintain mm. before go to, to the bottles. This is an old surgical light for a dentist. 
We just finished the tour of um, how they make the wine, and now we're going to go drink the wine. 15 years? It's been 15 years? Yes, yes. In America, you have everything. Let me see. I am is always the first to, to see try it. If, good if it's good or not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I trust you. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's good? Yeah, I like this. Oh, good. <laughs> also, I think it's, uh, it's uh, very cold. So, uh, I offer for you. Oh, thank you. Wow. That's so cool. He... He is also an artist, and he designed the label of the newer ones. We ended up having two glasses of wine. We had one that was 15 years old, and one that was five months old. And there was a really big difference that we could we could really taste it. It was amazing, and um, they were nice enough. The man here who owns the Spaniard was nice enough to give us a bottle of wine that is two years old. So we'll be trying that on a special occasion, maybe when we get to Porto. plant lives inside a hole of volcanic rock and the volcanic rock heats up by day and then that keeps the plant nice and warm overnight. vineyard his family also owns this little church and they use it for weddings and intimate occasions it's really cute in the car to pick up my mom from the airport. She's gonna be the first person to visit us since we left the United States. It's really exciting. But her flight was delayed an hour. So, so well, far. <laughs> sort of an hour. It's been delayed. It's been delayed many times. Yeah, she was supposed to arrive at 7 a.m. She has spent 24 hours in various airports trying to get here. Yeah. All right, so Reddy's mom's here, so we're going to be doing a tour of the island and everything, seeing all sorts of sights that we really love here and we want her to see here. Okay, we're beginning our first day. My mom is here. Say hi. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> and um, we're going to be doing a lot of tourism today, so it's a beautiful day. Hopefully it'll stay that way and first thing we're going to do is get breakfast.
it was very beautiful in there. The architecture in these cathedrals is very simple. It's like concrete inside and they have a few dark paintings along the walls. Uh, so it's simple, but it's elegant. We're going on my favorite walk. It's a tiny little walk, but we, we do it when we have time because it's just so beautiful. Algar du Carvao. Came here with some friends a couple months ago and it was the same exact weather. <laughs> here, Mom. Here's the island. Uh huh. Oh, right now. oh my right goodness. In the right in the island. center. Mm -hmm. Okay. Last time we were here, I didn't notice all of those white stalagmites. Tights. 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 White stalactites um, that are like drippy and wrinkly and foldy. They're really cool. And also, I didn't know that the black areas of this are. Oh my gosh, it happened again! <laughs> It's not on the outside at all, it's just on the inside. <laughs> Black smooth glassy type material, these coverings, which resulted from the lava drawback into the conduit, are mainly composed of obsidian, usually a lateral, as lateral drippings or suspended blades. So yeah. it's, it's obsidian. When you break obsidian, it's sharper than a surgeon's scalpel. Whoa. And they, that's what they did on their spears. I am failing here. Here's the uh, chocolatey looking one. Yeah. And I don't know what that is. Yeah. It's gorgeous though. I kind of want to take a picture of it. And a little furry furry and I grow here. This is my light. This okay. is my world. <laughs> grow in the darndest places. One of them is here, and uh, we love calla lilies because they were our wedding flower. Hey. <laughs> yes, that feels good. <laughs> oh, he's going again. There he goes. Whee! Oh. So now we're here at Serra de Cum, and there is visibility. The cloud seems to have just moved. You may want to hurry though, because there's a cloud coming. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Look at that cloud. Look at that. The wind is insane right now.
So the last thing that we're gonna see today, while the sun's still up, is this gorgeous lookout. Uh, it's the one with that three-sided-ish church. That's not a church. It's kind of a weird structure. But it's a gorgeous lookout at the top of this mountain. And it's just absolutely amazing. So obviously, we had to bring her here because this is one of the sights to behold on the island. back to town, uh, back to the boat, get dressed, get ready, and then we're going to dinner because we got a delicious dinner with a ton of friends planned. So we're very excited for that and we got to get going. <laughs> They're the flowiest pants in all the land. <laughs> Make sure they don't get hooked on the top of the ladder. Um, it is that delicious place we went and tested out just the two of us a couple weeks ago. So we're excited to be meeting a group of nine other people there. <laughs> we're we're going to be a group of 11 so that my mom can meet all of our friends here. We ordered nine filet mignons and two ribs. <laughs> Steak for one. Off. <laughs> yeah, the last, but the other two. And that town is where we're headed to. <laughs> Alright, well here's an easy thing, or an easier question. This is amazing, we're now leaving, which is a crazy thing to leave something amazing behind. But where are we going next? Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And if you'd like to follow our journey in real time on a map, receive postcards from our ports of call and messages directly to the boat, you can go ahead and become a patron using the link in the description down below.